The Disability Committee at Rhodes University seeks to create an environment that is open to all students. But Mbongeni Shabangu, a student living with a disability at Rhodes, says the university is not doing enough to cater for the needs of the disabled. You find that one lectures on one side of the school, the other lectures on the other side of the school. And you know there's only 10 minutes in between lectures. So you find that I'd have to be, I'd be in a situation I have to pick which lecture, lecture I'm going to attend. As a visually impaired student, Mbongeni says not enough preparation was done by the university to make sure he is catered for. He also says that accessing information was difficult because it was organized in a manner that catered only for able-bodied students. An audit conducted in 2014 revealed that Rhodes University lacks the necessary infrastructure to make studying at Rhodes easy, which makes accessing libraries, lecture theaters, and computer labs difficult for disabled students. Indeed, there was a, an audit taking place, and the audit did seek to find out what is our infrastructure looking like. The general outcome is that our infrastructure is not as adequate as it should be. One, and certainly our infrastructure from a disability point of view remains a challenge. And so I think with that messaging out there and having come in one form or the other in the report, I think it has made it very clear to the institution that something needs to be done. Veronica Israel, Manager of Student Services at Rhodes says infrastructure is not the only limitation to recognizing the right to education for students with disabilities. The university lacks the necessary support systems to make studying at Rhodes with a disability a viable option. The vision of student affairs by the very nature of its, its, its title is around the affairs of students. So the approach that we take as the DSA office is the holistic development of our students. We want to be able to ensure their student success. If you look at a blind student, you need to have specific equipment or devices in place for a person like that, which raise the question, does Rhodes have the money? And which raise the question whether we put priority on challenging circumstances like that. The Disability Committee admits that a lot still needs to be done to create an inclusive culture at Rhodes and hopes to raise awareness around the rights of the disabled through its annual Disability Week campaign. I'm Atini Majali, RUTV, Grahamstown.